Hello everybody, it's Rhino and I am here at Disney Springs um, because, I know I keep, I keep showing up here at World of Disney, but uh, apparently there has been a new merchandise drop for the 50th anniversary uh, that happened just the other day or just yesterday as of the recording of this video. And uh, I'm here to check it out. Hopefully we get some more items than we did on that first drop, which was just like four or five items. But um, I think it's probably a lot more since the 50th anniversary is just over a week away right now. So we're gonna go in together, we're gonna check it out, see what they have, uh, see what's cool, what's not cool, and see if there's anything priced moderately or not. So, the usual. I just wanna remind everybody that this and everything that we do here is brought to you by Dreams Unlimited Travel. They are experts at helping you plan the perfect Disney vacation. You can visit them on the web at dreamsunlimitedtravel.com. When you book with them, it costs you nothing extra on your trip and you help support the channel and all the content that we produce here, okay? I've said it, now we're gonna go inside, we're gonna take a look. It's not super busy today at Disney Springs, but um, it's, I'm sure it's gonna be busy in here. So, uh, because it's new merch and I've seen people with bags and bags and bags of merch, so I know something was released, but uh, we're gonna take deep breaths, calming breaths. We have our mask, we're gonna put our mask on and uh, just have at it. So here we go, let's go inside. All right, we are actually going right in the front entrance today. This doesn't happen that often these days, I feel like, but I can already see some 50th stuff right there in the window. Yep, 50th stuff there, over here, over here. Looks like there's a good amount of it. So I can already see these like super cute Chippendales up there. Anyway, um, where do we start? Where do we start? Let's just start right here, right here. Oh, just kidding. Let's go around over here. We're going to take a look at these ears right here. That is a lot of bling. Doo, 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 doo. And as always, limited to per item per guest, but it goes per size. So you can get 10 of the same shirt as long as they're every two are in a different size. Um, do these have price tags on them? Nope. I have no idea. Disney doesn't like to put price tags on stuff anymore. That's their jam lately. So, and I don't see a price tag, but um, look at these guys. Look at them. They're so cute in their little outfit. They look so dapper. I'm a sucker for any of that uh, Chippendale 50th anniversary merch. Oh, and they got Pluto up here. His little collar. It's cute. He's 30 bucks. How much are Chippendale? They are also 30 bucks. Very nice. Look at this. I do like this sweatshirt right here. I like this color. Interesting. A double zippered hoodie. What? So it says most magical celebration. And then on the back. Oh. Some stuff on the back. How much are we looking at here? Let's check. 60. It's really nice quality though. This one's cute. I like this one a lot. I'm not gonna lie, I do not care for this shirt. I did not care for the Godfather. Mm -hmm. I do not care for this shirt. It looks like somebody works in an attraction. It's like a bowling shirt, I guess, I don't know. $60, too much, too loud. Too loud and too much money. I do like a good ring or two. Oh, look at this logo. It's cute, because you have like Dumbo, this Rex, Name Falcon, Tron. That didn't happen, but I'm assuming that means that will happen for the 50th. $36.99. Look at this water bottle. Walt Disney World. I know it's hard to see in my hand. I like this style of water bottle. It's 20 bucks. I don't know. I feel like that's a pretty good, pretty decent price for this. 50th. It's cute. It's cute. There's uh, two shirts here. There's the little t-shirt. I feel like we might have seen this before, but this is... $36.99, nice, and, nice quality, nice and thin. Let's take a look at this display too. People are very pushy and grabby today and I don't care for their attitude one bit. All right, so you got a 50th anniversary Walt Disney World coffee blend. I feel like this is gonna make its way to Denny's house, right? Am I right? I have no idea how much it is. Is this tea? Did they make tea? No, this is also, oh, they're the K-Cups. Okay, I was like, what? Does this one have price tags on it? No, I I must be missing something, but celebration popcorn. Anybody else remember this when they had this in the mall in the 90s? It's like lenticular 
postcards. Cute. And they have backpacks here. No, I'd love a good backpack. I love a good backpack. This is $54.99, but it's got plenty of pockets on either side. On the front, this can be where you put all your, your wipes and everything. Let's see if I can see the inside. Let's see what it looks like. That's interesting. It doesn't go all the way down on the inside. It's only a half, the top half. So the bottom half, this wide open part, is a whole different part of the bag. Might make a good camera bag. And of course, the Magic Band, the classiest Magic Band that ever was. $35. A bunch of different designs for it. I like this blue one the best, I think, though. It's like pink. Oh, God. Oh. All right, here we go. Into the thick of it. I'm just going to get grabby now, too, I guess. It's fine. It's whatever. I don't know what this is. Like a dish? Like a candy dish? $30. Seems weird. I don't know. I don't know. You want a puzzle? A thousand pieces. $24.99. There's this, like, throw over here. It's actually kind of cute. I don't like tassels on the end, though. I don't know how much it is either, so... Just for show, maybe? I don't know. All right, let's take a look over here. There's like the lanyard pouches. Those are $10. Good God in heaven. Gets the 50th logo icon, I guess. You got yourself a magnet. Or the castle that could be confused for sleep Cinderella Sleeping Beauty Castle. My goodness, at this point. It is Cinderella Castle, but I don't know why we made it look like the other one. Magnetic photo frame. Oh, Teal. Oh my gosh, and the pricing thing isn't over here, so I have no idea how you're supposed to know how much this is. $20, this is the one thing labeled over here. Um, besides the lanyards. Love a good tracksuit, not gonna lie. I thought I was gonna hate this, but I actually kinda don't. Like, I like the, uh, the iridescent lining on it. The pants are 50. They're really soft. Got the logo right there. And then there's the matching jacket. Which I like too. That is 65. Also very soft. Nice material. This seems like it's a heat press from a cricket though. Not like it's like on there. I feel like it could be could have been uh well I guess you can't really embroider when it's when it's like reflective like this, right? I don't know. Anyway, let me see if I can show you the model over here. Oh, decked head to toe. This guy means business. This guy's definitely going to yell at a cast member at some point. Oh, found a price on that throw. $75. It's not that cute. Got some of that Nike dry fit. Ooh, nice and thin. $75. Get out of here right now. But look, this one is embroidered. Nice. Simple. Plain. $75 for a polo, though. I wish I made that type of money. All right, we're going to try and get into the thick of it. There's a lot of rolls gold stuff here, a lot of congestion, but we're going in. I'm going in because, look, pajamas. $60. Ooh, silk pajamas. And you've got yourself your pink shirts. Little $36.99. Towels, $20. For one towel, get out of here. Get out. And then they have the new, ooh, sparkly. The drop test case. I like a good thin phone case. It's nice colors, I will say that. Nice colors, 60 bucks, which is the normal price for like an Autobox case, so. Not, not insanely priced or anything like that. We've got a long sleeve shirt over here. Oh my God, this is the softest sweatshirt I've ever touched in my entire life. This is $45. I can't get over how soft this feels. Look, it's got a little particular thing at the bottom. It's cute. And a little more. I, I do like that they've embraced this like design on the lining of stuff. Walt Disney World's most magical celebration. This sweatshirt, $55. 
There's another set of ears, and I didn't realize they light up. That's cool. That's cute. Those ones are $35. Here, oh, here's that hat. $45 for a hat? Come on now. Come on now. Here's another, another embroidered $60. Good God in heaven. We got a plain gray t-shirt with just Mickey on here that says, well, what do we want to take bets on? $36.99. You've got to be kidding me. I mean, this is a soft shirt, but $36.99 for literally a gray t-shirt with this on it. I feel like I could make one of these myself for less money. Way less money. Anyway, that's, that's me being cynical. It's fine. Okay, so there are also these, like, reusable bags over here that I just realized that people are, like, attacking um, so I don't know that I'm actually going to be able to make it over here. We'll see. They're fine. I don't know why people go crazy for reusable bags, though. All right, we're going to take a look here. Look, you got Tinkerbell on one side, 50th Celebration on the other side, and there's the medium-sized one that's got... Doo -doo -doo. And then there's the big one. People are so rude today. I can't even get over it. I, like, literally, I was, like, stepping up to this, and a guy jumped in front of me to grab a bunch of them. And, like, I'm, like, I'm just taking a picture. They're just reusable bags, bro. So I think that's everything at, like, the front of the store, but I see a big giant 50 back here. Yeah. And um, so I am going to just, like, walk back this way, and we're going to take a look and see. Because this is probably, like, I feel like there was all adult stuff up there, and this must be where, like, all the kids' stuff is. I see some other things back here too. So, so let's journey. Oh, look at the giant lollipop for thirty dollars. Get out of here, kids! Kids don't need it. Don't need it. Don't need it. Got the water bottle, the blankets back here. Oh, there's another soft blanket. This one doesn't even have a photo of what it looks like on it, but forty dollars. Oh, there it is. I'm an idiot. Oh my god, here's something that everybody I feel like is looking for. This is $14. This is that Mickey soap dispenser that when you like push it down in your hand, the soap is like Mickey's head. $14.99 though for a soap dispenser. Oh, see, there's a demonstration. I mean, it's cute. I know people are like, this was the hard to get item from like one of the international parks, but I don't know. I like my $2 bottle of soaps at Target. Minnie's in her dress, looking sharp. Gonna be nice today because it's their 50th. 30. Oh, look at the, look at the kids dress, holy moly. Holy guacamole, that is $100. Buy it and then make her wear it to prom. Um, so I haven't seen Mickey. I guess Mickey was very popular because I see Chip and Dale and Pluto and Minnie. Mickey maybe needs a restock. I don't know. I see tons of stuff back here, actually. I see, like, lounge flies and stuff. So we're going to keep going. We're going to just keep going. Here we go. There's that T-shirt again. I like that shirt. I wish it wasn't blue. Um, here's the 50th lounge fly. Actually pretty nice. Pretty big, to be honest with you. Pockets on the side. I'm going to say $75. I would have said $80. So, look at that. Look at that. Saved $5. There we go. Just plain, classic Mickey. $25. And it's a soft shirt. That's how much that other shirt should have been priced for. That's nicer, too. I don't see a price on it. Oh, does this one have a price? $24.99. I think this might be a kid's hat. There's the home of the characters. I kind of like the faded, I like that faded blue line, $36.99. Top sockets with the little $14.99. Then they have the pop socket wallet. That one's $35. Oh my gosh. Magnets, our characters on it, $14.99. And what's this? Keychain. What's that button? Souvenir pack. That is twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Let's go around here. Do we have chip? Chip bag? Bag? Magnetic clips? I don't want to say chip bags. It's just a clip. Red. Red. 
mint. Yeah, I do like this yellow sweatshirt because you know what? There's like nothing else colored like this. It's cute. Okay. I don't see that color that often, but here's a another shirt. This one's got mini on it. $36.99. It's like a, oh, just shove back in here. Holy mo guacamole. There is a 50th anniversary. Uh, look at this, a bomber jacket. I know my friend Jill is gonna want this, I feel like, cause it's like iridescent. It's very back to the future, $50. I believe this is kids, but she wears child sizes sometimes. Another set of track pants. I like these ones because I like how blatantly showy they are. These ones are $50, $50. Got all the ears back here. Here's that really soft sweatshirt too. Why don't they make a guy's jacket of this? I mean, I guess this could be a... Well, my shoulders aren't going to fit in there. You know, everybody is going to be thrilled. We got some 50th Crocs. I get it. People love their Crocs. Whatever. Can't stop the... I can't stop the movement. I won't, I won't try either. You know what? If you're comfortable and it makes you happy, and that's all that matters to me. We saw all this stuff. Except for there is a pin back here with the different characters on it. And then uh, there's like a little itty bitty big head Mickey. Look at him. That's cute. Teal. I have, I, they, you know, they really need to put the, uh oh. Uh oh. 50th anniversary fanny pack. $30. This is awful quality, though. It is, like, super cheap. Just the one standard. Oh, nope. It's got a second pocket inside. This is very tempting. You're fine. Mm -hmm. I think this is probably for children. Nice. It fits. It fits around me. I don't know. I don't know. It's really cheap quality. 30 bucks. I mean, we do get a discount. This Walt part is embroidered with that, oh, and world, but nothing else is, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It is a little small, but it's like the right size to like hold my wipes and hand sanitizer stuff in here, so it could be a Sani Fanny, you know? Clorox wipes, hand wipes, and hand sanitizer. And then the little pouch can hold, you know, whatever, wallet, ticket or something, but I don't know. I don't know. 30 bucks. I don't know. I don't know. It's nice and compact, but I'll put it back. And if I feel, if I lose sleep over it, then I'll have to come back, I guess. But yeah, I just can't keep buying fanny packs or uh, backpacks or any of that stuff, you know. It's cute. I wish they'd... Probably should have made this in adults too, right? $14.99. I think this is like infants with the little ears on it. Very cute. Very cute. There's some more down here. Little kid sweatshirt. That is $35. And then this mini onesie is $30. There's like a little cute shirt. I like this shirt. That's $20. Oh, they did make this jacket in adults. Hmm. I don't... It's not my color. But I do like the iridescent nature of it. So I, I don't actually think this was an adults area. It might... Well, for women. It's probably women's. That's why. Because I was like, this large is not for men. The one I was holding up was a 3XL on a large hanger. So... I, I believe these are either child sizes or for women which is fine. Just get little, little pants for the little kids. $24.99. Oh, that's cute. I like that. I like that. Are these fancy macarons? Sandwich cookies. No, okay. I don't know. They look like macarons. $14.99 for those. $7 for the fancy popcorn. 
And guess what? There is this castle place set over here. Make, make kind of a nice display piece because you got like making stuff. There's like a Dumbo thing. You know, put your family photos around the front of it. I already got the Lego castle in my house, so I don't, I don't need any of that stuff. But somebody might. Okay, so I know that I saw there was a large lollipop. Does this mean there's a large candy bar too? Oh, there's mints. Hmm. Yep, I didn't even realize this was the candy bar. $25 for a candy bar. $5 for the mints. And I don't know how much for the lollipop, and I'm not touching it. But we are going to take a look right here to see what this is. Oh, see, this is something that's very useful in this little pouch. Reusable utensils, $20. It's a nice little pouch, though, too. You could use it for something else if you wanted to afterwards, but it's very nice. Very nice. And then we've got a uh, reusable straw here. Comes a little cleaning kit. It's a cute little thing. That is $10. Take that to Animal Kingdom with you so you don't have to use the you don't have to use the paper straws. You can stop complaining about it too. No, okay. That's definitely an adult size jacket right there. So they have them either in both kids and adults, but that, judging by these sizes, I'm seeing 100% adult. That's the mystery of this video, isn't it? What's adults and what's kids? <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, and we got a little bit of these starter packs of these pins. This is $32.99. We got the Mickey. I think I already showed this. I don't remember anymore. $20. I don't remember. I just keep getting overwhelmed. But let's see if you can see if there's different pins. Because there's Mickey Minnie, Chip and Dale, Daisy, and Donald. Then there's like the plain castle one. That one's kind of nice for like a little memento because it's like that iridescent thing. Silver. Silver is $10. This one's really not bad. This one's like 10 bucks. I don't know. The quality's a little cheap, but nice little memento, I guess. There you go. Just your typical. Then there's these like little mystery pins. Oh, Denny, there's a Ratatouille one here. Some more. I know I saw that little sweatshirt back there, but I don't know if this like spirit jersey is part of the 50th or not. I feel like I've seen it before. Yes, I am holding the fanny pack. No, I am probably not getting it. Um, then you got the soap dispensers over here. And you got the tie-dye collection still going strong. I think we saw a lot of it. So it's at the front of the store and then at the back of the store. So it's in multiple locations. So if you come in the front, go to the back. It's not all kids stuff back there, even though it's like in that, uh, where I feel like the kids section kind of was. So I'm going to take a walk around and see if I find anything else. Oh. I need one of these fans, I feel like. I am always overheating, and I carry that battery-powered fan, but this might be a nice backup to have in my backpacks. Oh, yeah. So they have Haunted Mansion. What else do we have? Stitch, cute. And then there is... What do you say? I don't know, I'm assuming that says fabulous or fantastic or something. Almost missed this before. Stepped on it. But also, look, I don't know if these are out and I just missed them. A little iridescent ear. Just the super basic, basic ones. That'd be cute for anybody coming. Get your name uh, embroidered in the back. It looks like there's some 50th anniversary Alex and Ani as well. Oh my gosh. That's $70 here for this one. And then there's the, like, the bangle bracelet. Is that the right word? 65. This one with the little Mickey ears. Oh my God, nothing wants to come off. That's 60. $60. From this ornament. Yeah. That's $30. These two happy families. Very happy because they have a giant pencil for some reason. I do not understand the pencil at all. But they both have one. So good for them. So there you have it. That is uh, all the 50th merch that I saw inside of there. There could be more. 
Um, but I, I walked around and tried to find stuff throughout the store. And, you know, there's like one or two things here and there. So I'm sure I, I'm sure I missed some stuff, you know, and I'm sure that more stuff will be released as it's an 18 month celebration, but people are grabby, grabby, grabby and going crazy in there. Like anytime I would go and look at anything, it's like somebody immediately would grab it. Like, I don't know how many times I had something in my hand and somebody was touching it at the same time as me, like picked up off the rack and they walked over and started touching it. And I'm like, I, that, this is mine. This is in my hands. So, um, so, you know, like I said, just have patience for that. Deep breaths. I recommend just getting a basket or a cart or one of those like reusable bags and just start shoving your stuff in there so that way you don't have to deal with that. You know, remember, you can always put stuff back down, but you can't, oh, you might not always have the opportunity to pick it back up. So, better just grab and go. I did not get anything. Um, ultimately, I feel like the fanny pack, 30 bucks, a little, 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 little too much for what it is. Not, not, you know, just very tiny and everything like that. Cute, but talk myself out of it, which is fine. Uh, it'll be, it's fine. It's good. I don't need it. I th honestly, overall, I think there's some cute stuff. I don't, I, you know, it, not everything can be a winner, but um, I'm more impressed with it this time around than I was with that initial drop. I feel like there's a lot, uh, there's, the stuff's a little higher quality this time in terms of like the material feels better in the shirts. There wasn't a ton of like home wear stuff, right? Like there weren't like mugs. It was just the water bottle and stuff. So I'm positive there is more stuff to come. All right, let's all take a breath. That was our shopping trip. Thank you for joining me on this trip. Uh, if you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Like I said, leave comments about the merch that you saw this cute, something you're looking forward to. It did seem like as much as everybody was grabbing, 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 because I'm sure all the, the eBay resellers and Disney shoppers are in there and everything like that. It seemed like things were getting restocked pretty regularly. The only thing I didn't see that restocked while I was standing in there, and I was in there for like, probably over an hour, was um, the Mickey Mouse plush. But I'm sure he'll come back and we'll find him somewhere else on property. But yeah, everything that essentially got grabbed and pulled off the shelves, they would immediately come back out and put more stuff on. So I don't, I'm hoping that they anticipated a rush and that there'll be stuff for people as you, as you get here. And they don't sell out a 50th merch before the 50th even officially begins, but we'll see. It's Disney, anything can happen these days, right? So again, thank you everybody for joining me and um, I hope you're doing well and I'll see you soon. Goodbye.